Jay sent me an email and said, look, I want you to play this iconic man, Rupert Murdoch. So I laughed because, you know, Rupert Murdoch's quite somebody that, you know, is one of the titans. And um, he said it wasn't big, it wasn't, but it was very important because there's a certain gravitas and um, he's a terrific character to play, even though I don't have that many scenes. Look, it's really, you know, uh, Roger Ailes' story as told from the women's point of view. So, which makes it very interesting. It's not just about him. It's, it's the reaction of his presence on all these people that work for him. And so it's sort of interesting, you know, that at the end, Rupert has to come in and fire him, basically. So, no surprises there. Of course, I had to work on the accent, you know, and, and they put this incredible chin. Um, so that was fabulous, and that really did help. It, it sort of um, gave him a gravitas, you know. So that was fantastic, and um, we just went from there. There's a, a lot of the cast are playing living people, you know, and, and very recognizable people. And so it's kind of cool, and um, it, I've never really used prosthetics in a big way before. I did years ago in a horror movie called Cat People, but I used a bit then, but um, I don't usually get cast in these roles, so I'm, I'm really happy to do it because it sort of does the acting for you.